Good morning, my YouTubians. How are ya? Another early day, another early morning to go to work. Okay. This shout out goes to Trey57. You know, Trey, it's a uh, far cry from people not wanting to defend themselves in a home defense situation. You know, the thing is, they're not prepared for it mentally, physically, and, you know, basically, I know a lot of people that are anti-gun. I know. And it's just unbelievable. And by the way, I don't, I don't believe in the death penalty unless, unless this person actually deserves it or if he's a waste to society. I believe, you know, I believe that you spend more money trying to execute a person than you do housing them up and feeding them. So I think that's up for them to take the cheapest way out. Anyhow, back to these anti-gunners. They, you know, I got a couple of texts this week and it's ridiculous, you know? It's like, okay, look, I am not participating in a gun buyback program. It's not gonna happen. And then a message, and I know this is BS, and I didn't, I, I don't dare respond to them because it could be scams. Somebody asked me how many guns do I have? Uh -huh. I am not gonna answer that question in full, and I am not gonna tell them what I have. And you know, basically, if they saw it on YouTube, then that's how many I have. But other than that, I don't disclose certain information that will uh, have them thinking like, see, that guy could possibly go to, into a supermarket. Yeah, I'll go into a supermarket to shop. But you know, the thing is with these anti-gunners, they just won't let up, you know? And the gun buyback program, all it is is a sham, you know? They say, well, we're gonna get guns off the street. I go, okay, well, then you better stand in line because there's a lot of people. And like I said before, Second Amendment is in place so we do not get red dawned because no country in their right mind is stupid enough to parachute in here, fly in here, whoa, and, and say, okay, we're going to take over this little town here. <laughs> yeah, not when everybody's armed, go for it. So the thing is, all you people that are anti-gun, I mean, maybe you should listen to these messages a little clearer because... Obviously, you don't get it, you know? Like Trey57 says, get with it or get left behind. And you want to know something? I see a lot of people being left behind. Not left for dead, left behind. Clueless, clueless, and pretty soon zooless, because that little zoo or household that you have has no protection. And, you know, the thing is, I'd rather play it smart. And as far as that little, oh, God, they're going to start imprinting firing pins. Well, the thing is, well, that 86 is my chances of buying another firearm for now. Unless, unless I decide to. But, you know, the fact is, the Second Amendment is here to stay. They can't change it. They can't amend it. Only thing a person could do is lose those rights if they just purposely go out and commit a crime. They know this. And that's the reason why they keep pushing for it. You know, we should end the Second Amendment. We should end all of this. No, it's not going to happen. So, the thing is, get with it, get left behind. That's Trey 57's slogan. Not my slogan. My slogan is, get with it. Get with it. Oh, God, there's some cops right over here. See? Good example. Good example. Oh, boy. The Mesa Police at its best. Yay, team. Anyhow, nothing wrong with cops. 911, useless. I'm gonna go down the line. 911, very useless. Useless in any situation. Somebody kicks in your door at your house, repel borders, period. Know where your firearm's at. Know how to use them. Know how to load them, especially. And for God's sakes, keep them away from kids. I mean, Jesus, it's like, it's like preaching to a 10-year-old that there's no candy in the little box here and Halloween does not happen except every 200 years, you know? So just remember this in mind. Have yourself a plan, because God knows I already do. I already have part of my bug out bag done. And the thing is, my firearms are here to stay. 
not going anywhere. They're not going nowhere. You want me to give them up? Try to make me give them up and see what happens. Because last time I remember, uh, <laughs> dead shot Mark, <laughs> let them try. Uh, anyhow, I'm at work right now, but I can tell you this. You folks have a good day. Think about what I said. Arm up. And uh, that doesn't mean pick up your arms and go start some shit. That does not, that's not what that means. What it means is buy yourself a firearm, protect your home, protect your family. That doesn't mean that you go off on some psychopathic rage. You know, if that's what you do, you know, if that's how you think, then you must be terribly dyslexic. So that being said, arm up. Okay. Arm up now while, before it's too late. Be safe. Have a good night. Subscribe, Trey57. Subscribe, BI, Big Stan McGee. All the above. And especially, especially the big man T Electric. I'm on their Secret Service detail. I'm part of their Secret Service. So, you got any questions for me? Throw them at me. I'm not going to answer for them, they can answer for themselves. But I won't answer any question, you know, so take care of yourself.